everybody. This is uh, Freik and Jos, and we are here in Uganda, and we uh, we preach the gospel, we heal the sick, and we casted out demons, and it was really amazing. So much happened in like 12 days, and we love it. And God is amazing, and He did so many miracles, and many people are following this example. Mm. And how is this dizziness now? Mm. Dizziness be gone right now in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, I set you free from all dizziness right now in Jesus' name. Go, go, go in Jesus' name. Leave this man right now. Right now in the name of Jesus. Right now in the name of Jesus. Complete healing. In Jesus' name. How is your dizziness? When he's moving, he can feel it. Yeah, but now he's not feeling it. So come back So we're going to pray for you again. Do it again what you did just before. Again. I command the pain to go in the back in the name of Jesus. Freedom, freedom, freedom. You the pain, go out of this body. You have no house here. I command the pain to go. Freedom, freedom. All right. In the name of Jesus. That's enough. Can she test? Can she try? Mm -mm. She's now feeling okay. 
So what is she's trying to explain that disturbing the, the problem in the bar. Mm-hmm. She was on the on the motorcycle mm-hmm. and she falls down oh. and the, her back broken. All right. Yes. Okay. So we're gonna can we lay her hand? And we pray. We can. Me? Is it okay? Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. I think you can do it. You can do it. I. Yeah, of course, we have the same Holy Spirit okay. and the same faith. Okay. So, She's okay with it when I lay my hands on her back and I pray. She's okay. okay. And loud. Okay. So she can hear it. You can do it in Uganda. In Uganda. Yeah. Okay. 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 Uradi kwa mbili kuna toi na maka. Never committed one crime. Let him or her stone these women. And then all the people who were angry at the woman and left, left the woman and 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 woman and left the woman and left the woman and left the woman and left the woman and left Say the good These story. Words Jesus says to everyone of you, Jesus has come for the forgiveness of your sins. And you can you can just say, God, I want to live with you. And you will always be. And you don't have to be stoned anymore. Because Jesus has come to bring forgiveness. Alright? So thank you for listening. I love you. And remember, Jesus is alive. <laughs> The one and only God who created every human being. But he loved us. He loves you. So he sent his son, Jesus Christ, to rescue you, to to free you from your sins. So you will be free. Because Jesus says that everyone who sins is a slave to sin. So that means that when you lie once in your life, you did... Yeah. You are a slave to sin. That means that there is someone, a big boss, telling you what to do. You have to obey to sin. Now Jesus Christ came to set you free from that. And he came to forgive you everything you've done and to make you a new person and he did the same with me two and a half years ago I became a new person and that's why I'm here because Jesus Christ is alive and if you have if you believe in his name in the name of jesus christ you will be saved so i have a question to all of you i have a question to all of you a very important question 
If you want to be saved, repent. Change your mind. Be baptized. And you will receive His Holy Spirit. Which will help you. So you will become part of Jesus Christ. And you will have everlasting life. Everlasting life. It's amazing. Don't be afraid. So this lady, uh, she was uh, um, having troubles with uh, familiar spirits and they were troubling her. And uh, w what happened to you in there, in the church? You can you can speak in Luganda. He will translate. When she was still schooling, mm -hmm. friends of her mom, mm -hmm. they sent uh, some spirits to her. That spirits never wanted her to be educated. Mm. Because they thought that if she would be well off when she studied, her mother would be well off and she won't be disappointed by the world mm. when she has no soul. Mm. And she was really disturbed during her studies. Whenever she was at school, she was here. And when she, she reached in form for us in high school, she did the exams when he was there. Uh, at the, in the hospital. She was really going to be sick every day, every day. And they, when they took him to the hospital, surprisingly they were saying that he, she had no any sickness or any illness. They do got uh, different uh, uh, operations on her, but they thought uh, in, the, in the hospitals, but they thought nothing. Then she continued then, uh, and reached the step when she failed. Whenever she tried to work, things were not going well. The spirits were attacking her when hindering her to do that work. They came and they spoke and they said that they want her to be at home so they could not, never leave that home. And whenever, when she got pregnant, they, if she found different, uh, difficult in delivery, and uh, the, mm -hmm. uh, the child was spread in the womb. And that during the, the time back, the, the child was really stunted. She couldn't, the, the, the child never grew, and uh, it didn't, it was, it was not in a good situation. When the enemy saw that he uh, come back again home, he sent more spirits to her. They caught and they took her to the church, and she decided to get saved. Hmm. Today she came to a meeting, a conference, because she has been fellowshipping for me since she got saved. She, she, she got saved during the, the beginning of this month, so now it's one month in salvation. Mm. When they asked for people who have problems or need to be prayed for, she decided to come and so they can be prayed for. She had faith in her heart and then she came in front and they, she was prayed for. They laid on hands on her, then now she is really delivered. And her son is really delivered right now. And today she believes all the family, all the her and the, her, her child, they are delivered. Mm -hmm. She thanks God for that. Oh, yeah. uh, did you notice anything during uh, the praying? So I felt something getting out from me.
freedom, freedom, freedom. Kill it, I'm a sick da 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 But you have to surrender and be baptized. So, so that's and, and and when you get up, you get resurrected just like Christ. And you can start. That's where your new life starts. Free from sin. And you're righteous now. So instead of me wanting more money, I now want others to have more money. Instead of like doing everything to get better myself, I now care about others. And not because of me. But because of what God has done. It's, it's grace that I am standing here the way I am now. Because I was a sinner just like you. And Jesus saved me. And naming you. Amen. So that's the second part. It's baptism for the, in water for the remission of your sins. Yeah. And then the third part comes. So that's all done. And then we receive the Holy Spirit, the gift of God. His spirit, which is holy, righteous, loving, patient. I mean, the Holy Spirit is the bomb. He's just everything. Yeah, he's really everything. Everyone loves him if they know him. So that's what you see.
Yeah. So, would you want to pray for this man? I would love that, but it's the grace of God too. <laughs> okay, well, pray for him. Yeah. So you lay your hands on, on the leg that's shorting. Yeah. And you command it to be evil. Evil. In the name of Jesus. Can we do that together? Yeah, sure. It takes, it takes the Holy Spirit. Yeah. The short, yeah, the short yeah. leg. Oh, the short leg. Because you don't want to miss this miracle, you want to see it. Do you feel in it? In Jesus' name. It's quite a distance. In Jesus' name. You probably feel it. <laughs> we command this to be equal in the mighty name of Jesus. You're almost there. Yeah. It's amazing, huh? Yeah, it is. Good free. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. There's a few millimeters. Yes. Sometimes uh, we are not keeping it straight and then the yes, yes, there's yes, a difference. Yes, yes. But the Holy Spirit knows best. So you can finish it. If you want it to go faster, you can speak to it. And it has to listen. Yes, be equal in the name of Jesus. I command you in the mighty name of Jesus to be equal right now. So I will put them now down, and then you can sit back again, and I will check again. Yeah. Try to relax, let them hang your feet, try to relax. So almost there. Yeah. See, it's, I see it's already. It's now same. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. equal. So, could you stand up and bend down and see if you feel anything? If you feel anything? No. <laughs> Thank God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. Amen. <laughs> wow. This is what we did there. Where did you do the thing? Yeah. Yeah. You enjoy? Okay. Yeah.
the people sign, you'd be crying for 